Tell us what is going on with the slumping, failing Chinese economy that nobody talks about, Anna. A lot of the media that we see online, the mainstream, they are not talking about this. Because we know a lot of American people, your pension funds, educational funds, a lot of the funds of your heart and money has been invested into the economies of communist China. The Morgan Stanley's research team have all stated that China, as well as Hong Kong, now under the CCP's control, have lost a huge money and also the outflow is actually humongous. So this is what we have already seen uh, in the past week for the grassroots in China or if it's in the West, in America, they still have the idea that the Chinese economy is thriving. But the truth is, in recent years, one of the biggest troubles of the CCP is facing the troubles, first of all, in the municipal bonds, the local banks, uh, like I said, the property markets, and then the stock markets. The Lunar Chinese New Year is just right around the corner. So at this time, the CCP definitely want to maintain the image of stability in the economic markets. We all know that she made a comment on stock markets. He actually claimed, as from our sources, that she said it does not matter if the market crashes. So the point here is the CCP kleptocrats, they have made huge profits from the Chinese stock markets. And they have ran away with all the money and stored them overseas. But for the Chinese people, or for the people like you and I, or the audience right now, your pension funds, your educational funds, your savings are invested into these markets. So if it flopped, you wouldn't even receive your principles, your capitals back. So this is the reality we have seen right now.